white. Now the red lights go on, green flag. And we are on for the second race of the week the Porsche Carrera Cup and Alex. And a good start of Walter Burkham seems to be. Can he hold the interior of the first right corner? No, it's no no no, it's door to door and it's Larry Tenvolde who keeps first position, but he had a not a bad start, but not a perfect start as well uh, neither. He's in first position, sliding through the long right-hander into the heavy braking for the first left-hander. Side of the racetrack, which means that Benjamin Park is now putting pressure on Robert De Haan. And again, De Haan is trying to go by Burakam Burakam, very spectacular into the chicane. Two wheels on the ground. And Benjamin Park trying to get past Robert De Haan. Good racing here. With some, I think, 15 to 16 minutes to go. Meanwhile, Larry, Larry is walking away. If you have people fighting behind you, that's a perfect way to create a gap. And there's some the young again who's fighting. He has to do it every race. This yellow flag at turn six. Let's hope we can continue racing. Not sure what happened there. There we have the top three yellow flag. Turn six. Turn six yellow flag has gone away now. Yep, yeah, it is. Oh, that was track limits. That was track limits as well. And there is Larry Tenvorde. Two seconds gap on Walter Burakam's Robert Dahan, Benjamin Park, Levan Perez, Sandy Over, Rick Poole, Flint Scurry, Aria Levy, and Mika Stanley. In Pro Am, Sasha Molde, and in Am Sedrin Chassan. And that's, oh, that's very wide. Some, Sandy was losing some places there. That might drop him outside the top 10. He's now under pressure from Lucas van Eindhoven in 11th position. But he's holding on to Lucas again and he's touching somebody on the back wheel. Perfect racing, sliding through the corners there. Good one-make series racing. And 
that's Mick Stanley off the road slightly. Best lap meanwhile, 138 9 of Larry Ten Voorde. Van Eindhoven is, yeah, he's in front now of Sam Leeuwen, this means Lucas Van Eindhoven in 10th. And Sam Leeuwen in, is trying again. Oh, good, good battle there, good battle. Oh, a little touch again. Keep it fair, boys, and there Lucas Van Eindhoven is going wide. Sam Leeuwen again. In front of him, Van Eindhoven under pressure. Waiting for the cars to pass the start finish line again. With best sector times on this lap again for Larry Ten Voorde. And he does a 138.4 now. Waterboer comes in second, Robert de Haan third, Benjamin Parkland from Paris. And it's now Skurin in sixth, Levy in seventh, Kuhn in eighth, Stanley in nine, and Sam de Jonge in position. They're a good fight of Dirk Schouten. He's trying to go by Lucas van Eindhoven. Oh, whoa, whoa, and that's a heavy boom. Ooh, that's into the gravel bed for both cars. I hope they can continue. That, well, that was a coming together. That's an incident, and I guess this incident will be investigated after the race. Really on two wheels flying there. Number 57, Dirk Scout in the Q1 track racing car, the yellow one. Yeah, and I, I think Dirk's race is over. Car is damaged, suspension damage or flat tire or boat. Two minutes later. And Dirk Scout is. Yeah, he's trying to restart. He is on his way again. So watch out when crossing the pit lane, please. Will he be able to continue the race? Anyway, he is down the order, of course. Safety car in this lap, Lucas Van Eindhoven watching the race with his helmet on. Several incidents noted and investigated about this race, but let's concentrate on the restart. Here is the safety car in again. And let's see where Larry Tomford will restart now. Last time it was at the entering of the last chicane. That's where we are now. He is waiting now. He is waiting. And it's the same, exactly the same spot. But the others are a little bit less surprised. The gap is closer now. Green flags waving. That means that we are racing again. Stanley, if I'm correct. That's Rikun, the number 9 car. The young Dutch talent as well. And we have 23 cars who look left now with the start in the last position, of course. Racing again. Sam Leon as well battling to get up higher in the order. And there is a big lockup from Mario Levy. And he's losing one, two positions maybe. One, two, Finn Schuring and maybe one to Rikun. No, Rikun is behind him. Big lockup again. Castelli behind Rikun now. Sam Leon. 
Chanot, die liegen mit Brandglas und die Orange and Blue Car. again, start finish, and it's of course Larry the Vorder leading the race. Robert De Haan is now second, second we missed this action of uh, Robert De Haan, while the Burkamps is back in third position, Glenn Van Perez is in front of Benjamin Park now, we missed some action in front of the race while we were watching this, guys, it's Sam Leon again, Fritz Schuring, Mika Stanley, Sasha Nord there. Hopefully we can get the overtaking in front of the race again. Double yellow at turn one now.
that's why we for them. Well, flying again. And there it is. Second victory of the weekend. Well done, Larry Tavorda. Well done, GW Race Service as well. Congratulations. Perfect. Second place for Robert Hahn because he's taken the winner's points, as I explained. And then we have Glenn von Pares, Walter Burekamps, Flint Schuring, Aria Levy, Benjamin Park, Rick Kuhn, Mika Stanley, Sam Leon. Winner of the pro -Am class, Sasha Norder. Hans Ray is the second now in Pro-Am. Cedric Chassang, first in M and 13th overall. And then the rest of the bunch. Good race, despite the safety car situations, of course. We prefer racing, crew racing, 